Hey everybody, it's Sam, and uh, this is our very first uh, sort of video review, so kind of bear with me. I'm kind of recording my iPad with my iPhone, so it's a little awkward. Um, but I really wanted to show you some of the enhanced features on the Art of Dead Space uh, Enhanced Edition. So uh, here's the artbook. It is pretty much the same as what you would get in print. Um, you can see it's it's on the iBooks uh, app, so you know it's, it's designed to look like a book. You flip, you flip the pages, I mean, pretty much know that kind of stuff. But what sets this particular um, the book art book apart when you're viewing it on the iPad is all of the little added features. So um, you can see here it talks about. Uh, if there's additional pictures, you'll see the little icon there. Um, they have videos input or uh, embedded into the thing. So, um, like this introduction video, you just watch. Welcome to the Art of Dead Space, the digital enhanced edition. And these are all there's a ton of special content in this particular version that we've created for you that like to have the digital stuff. A tremendous number of individuals have spent over eight years putting together the Dead Space universe. There's a ton of wonderful images, and they all show different sides of Dead Space, whether it's the classic stuff you got. And so, you know, they'll have a couple of videos in there where you'll have interviews with the particular, uh, with, with the artists and the producers. Um, I'll show you a couple other just pages so you can kind of get, get an idea. Um, let's see. All right, so this is the one I talked about in the actual review that I wrote up. Um, this is the, you see here they have kind of the setup of the helmet that Isaac wears. Um, and here, you know, they'll show each little aspect of it, but if you kind of want to apply what you're seeing, they've actually got a video there of each piece of the helmet kind of coming together. Um, which is kind of cool. You know, you can look at all the, uh, the little things, but you never quite really know what's going to happen. So they'll have little interviews and... Like this one. Um, they'll talk about how they develop the characters, where things are going from there. Um, here's another kind of one where they'll talk about kind of the show, add the video in to help you sort of see what they're talking about in the book. Um, and so, let's pause that, come back up here to the menu. And one of the other. Th sort of little features they have, which is really cool. Uh, I'll find a good example for you. Uh, let's try this page. You've got, if you see this little flashing plus sign there, you have a gallery. And it's full of images that didn't actually make it into the final cut of the art book. And so you otherwise wouldn't have the opportunity to uh, see. And you just kind of see sort of the evolution of some of these images, add different concepts, uh, and it's all, you know, really cool. You get to see some stuff that you wouldn't get to see otherwise. Um, and it's all because you can do a lot more and you're not limited by page numbers when it actually comes to having a, uh, a digital art book. So let's come back up here, uh, and you can kind of scroll through sort of the different pages, um, but, yeah, that's kind of, uh, that's kind of the art book, just wanted to kind of let you guys see it in action, uh, sometimes what I'm writing about seems really good and informative in my head and doesn't quite make sense, so, and with this, I think it really, really benefit from seeing what you're getting, um, from the digital art book, so, uh, hopefully you will check it out, and again, thanks to Titan Books for hooking us up with a uh, review copy. Uh, if you guys have any questions, post them in the comments, uh, either here on our uh, YouTube video, or you can post them on uh, the blog. Uh, and, you know, this is the first video we've done, so it probably sucks, but hey, uh, we'll see what we can't do in the future.